Hey, I'm Ghoul. Blah! And we're the Ghoul Grumps! Okay, welcome back to uh, our inexplicable second episode of Cursed Mountain. <laughs> Today we are walking around uh, the Cursed Mountain with a pickaxe. Yeah, it's never a good sign when the walkthrough you're reading, the first thing it says is like, run a lot, it'll make this game more bearable. <laughs> <laughs> what is he fucking saying? I feel like I have to turn this up to hear what he's because there's no subtitles. Make them all leave. What did he say? What is going on? Incense six can be ignited at the shrine of Sangumela to heal yourself. Oh, You're marked with a red glow. That's good. Thanks. You have two incense sticks. I've got more than that, buddy. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Spooky, scary. He uses that to write things with a pencil. Yeah, a ghost pencil. Ah! <laughs> Wait, <laughs> what's the lead of this pencil? It's a number zero. Ah! <laughs> That's really made with graph bite. Ah! Dude, I fucking totally forgot this until just now. But I had a teacher in third grade that demanded that we use number three pencils. What even is that? It was just like, you know, number two pencils are your standard. And, but like, number three is some shit that you have to specifically go to Staples for and ask. It's just got like a different, I guess, composition of uh, graphite. And it's fucking stupid as shit. But she was crazy. All my teachers were crazy and I had no idea because I was like, adults know what they're talking about. <gasps> Did you just see what the fucking message that came on the screen? What did it say? It was like, hold Z to jog. Be careful you don't alert any ghosts by jogging. Oh, well then. It's like, oh, oh, is that, is that really the first time you're gonna introduce the- <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, go on. After waiting a bit- Was that legit? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's that strange shape on the floor? Oh, God. It's a heart. Oh, I'll probably be better from now on, but before I knew that could happen, I was not prepared. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, like it was, there's something musical about it. Oh, thank you. It was beautiful. Right, well, My heart is racing right really now. really just coming out of nowhere, Whew. I think. I don't want to alert any ghosts. Yeah, no more jogging, please. <laughs> <laughs> Jog a lot. It'll make the game bearable. <laughs> Thanks, walkthrough guy. Oof. Oh, uh, nice mountain. Oh, it's beautiful. Mm. I hope it's not c c c c cursed <laughs> That's Mount Neverest. <laughs> Mount Neverest? Yeah. The mountain that no one goes to? Yeah, well, you, it never rests. Oh, yeah. Because it's a mountain. It's actually a functional moving mountain. Whoa. Oh, dip. Something creepy is happening. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, 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 oh. Hello there. Mm -hmm. oh. Welcome mm. to the dope show! <laughs> <laughs> it's like a really shitty Not haunted beautiful house. people! <laughs> <laughs> Bennett's telegram, diary note written by Frank. F was Frank the only person that's ever been to this town? <laughs> <laughs> Good God. A Sherpa believes that Bennett's expedition was doomed from the start. Ah, Haka Sherpa Sherpa. <laughs> Muhammad Jihad. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking <laughs> Bennett shows up and he's like, hey Sherpa, and he's like, yeah, and he's like, should I go climb the mountain? And he's like, nah. You no, know, that shit's cursed. He's yeah. like, really? Alright, I'll just stay home and write about it in my diary. <laughs> and then I'll inexplicably leave, and then let my brother go like, where did he go? Yeah, it's gonna be pretty good. It's gonna be pretty good. Where did he go? I don't know where he is. If this were a film, it would be starring Liam Neeson. Mm -hmm. I have to find Frank. <laughs> I have a very specific scatter of cells. I have very specific I have very specific spread of cells. <laughs> like, oh, what's in the pot? Yeah. 
What are you, you kids got pot in this town? Yeah, yeah, I'll break it open. Where's all the pot at? Crack open that pot. I'll wreck it all. I'll throw it all in the trash bin. This dude is not concerned with the ghost he just saw. Like, wouldn't you get the fuck out of this town? Oh, ghost. Ghost area. Oh, good. Ghost area. Eh. Oh, no, we're good. Okay. So I guess I'm not supposed to jog when it gets gray. Oh. I'm assuming that's the whole situation of it. Oh, wow. That's a beautiful carpet. Huh. It's super lovely. Wow. What's take, this? take. A small, well used key. Yeah. Excuse me, do you mind if I take this key, sir? Hey! <laughs> that looks comfy! Excuse me! <laughs> God, so rude in this town. Yeah, what the fuck is wrong with me? Oh, frick. Oh, dear. Uh, Mom <laughs> told me I couldn't go out tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I don't care. I'll, I'll just, just kneel here. here. She'll think I'm not the same person as her son. <laughs> and then Mom told me I could. <laughs> uh. Should I go through this door? No. Should I go through that? I think I can only go through the big doors. Oh, okay. Back up. Yeah, okay. Don't fucking turn around and walk forward. Mm-hmm. Ah, da da da. I'm a jogging fiend. Oh, no, can't go through that big door. Alright. Did they really build this empty-ass fucking town just for me to walk? Oh, hold on. Oh. Scary ghost. Sir. Sir. Scary ghost. Yep. Say goodbye to Chomalonzo. <laughs> the girl says goodbye to the valley forever. Okay. Is it just like- <laughs> is, is it like his recounting of what he just found was? I guess? It was a book, and like, yeah. they used- they used of a lot. Yeah, it was- It was uh, weird that they said of all the time. It was Moby Dick, it was, it was a little creased in the spine <laughs> region. Call me Ishmael. <laughs> what are you, Metal Gear Solid 5? <laughs> I don't get that it's, it's, reference. It's- it's- there's a lot of Moby Dick references in- Are there really? Episode 5, yeah. I'm reading it right it, now. Call Me Ishmael is in- Metal It's Gear very good. Five. Sir? <laughs> Do you want to dance? <laughs> yeah. 17,000 feet. And acclimatized. I should be hallucinating. Ba-ba-ba-ba-da. A monk. I don't believe this. The monk gestures. Like a ritual. The ghost shrinks. As if it's in pain. It's... gone. Oh, this can't be real. It's real as fuck, yo! <laughs> oh, he's just there! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, let me, let me, let me lead you into the real ghost quarters. <laughs> oh, they're real, they're all right. <laughs> we keep it real as shit up here in Tibet. No matter. Each of us has a third eye. Although few use it to see. This game would be way more effective and scarier if you could understand and hear what they're saying. It won't let me move. Hold C to use the third eye. Oh, your second sight. Whoa. Oh shit. Rip the symbol out of the shrine. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. <laughs> Key up. Okay. Oh. Ha! Huh. Ah. Now perform the complete ritual to purify the shrine of Senge Mala, the Supreme Healer. Once purified, it will allow you to heal yourself using incense sticks. Oh. Ha! Huh. <laughs> yeah, shit is pure as shit. <laughs> yeah, I did that. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> it's real as fuck, yo! <laughs> I was still thinking about it, too. <laughs> it's just his face. <laughs> oh, god damn it. The, you know what? This game has some great ideas. It's just the execution. Oh. Last. What did he just- oh. Okay. Did you? Did you just fart and then walk away? <laughs> God fucking asshole. I'm using my third eye to see who farted. <laughs> Stink trails coming from your butt. <laughs> Look at you, Frank. 
<laughs> you can see Frank's stink trail? <laughs> I can see many things. <laughs> Holy did, shit. Did I do? Oh, hold on. I guess I have to use my third eye. Oh. Right. Maybe. Maybe not. Mm -hmm. No. Wait, what did that say? Did it say I needed a key? To open this? Something feels strange about it. I am unclear. I like how he tries like one last time. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. To open it, you need to find something that will break the symbols. Uh, my axe. Sure. It does that, right? Okay. Maybe not. Oh, it just stays there now? Oh. Alright. I guess I'll find something to break the door then. Next time on Game Grumps! No, I don't think so. I don't think- I don't think this has it. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hey, come on. <laughs> I think we've already hit our peak with this one. Okay, all right. Oh, man. I'm going to get exactly three super angry emails that we didn't con uh, continue Cursed Mountain. Yeah, maybe. Next time on Game Grumps. Yeah, three's my guess. Episode three. <laughs> yeah. Of Cursed Mountain. Yeah, that's the one. A Sherpa's first impression of Frank Simmons. You guy's fat! <laughs> like, what did he think? Yeah. It's- it's so stupid! Yeah, uh, yeah. Maybe you can- can you read those more? It's like- it's like, you need a thing to open this door. Find a thing that breaks the seals, and then you find a book, and it's like, a book about breaking seals. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, look in your inventory. See if you can read the books. books. Expedition notes? What was it, like, a uh, journal? Frank's diary. Bennett's telegram. There you go. Oh. I got a telegram from Edward Bennett saying if I dropped everything and came right away, he would fund me on an expedition to Chomalonzo. Oh, Chomalonzos are delicious. He said Chomalonzo doesn't exist. You, you don't say no to a man like Bennett, especially with a mountain that he's never been summoned. I, I so was I, thinking of chimichangas. <laughs> never mind, please continue. So I came halfway around the world and here I am in Lando. More crowds <laughs> Hey baby, how'd you get in me? <laughs> I couldn't pay <laughs> me to live here. Now I don't know how Bennett stands it. All right, useful information. Yeah, yeah, just another example of the glory that awaits us. The curse, we <laughs> yeah. curse mountain. Next time on Game Grumps. See you then, everybody. Bye. Love you. Happy joke for you.